One of the most startling images from the disaster came from a nursing home in the city of Dickinson. Here's Omar Villafranca. It is an image that is quickly coming to define Hurricane Harvey. Stranded senior citizens, many suffering from dementia, in a Dickinson, Texas nursing home, stuck in floodwaters up to their waist. The owner's daughter and son-in-law, Kim and Tim McIntosh, went to Twitter and looked online for a lifeline. We were desperate. I mean, we were desperate to get someone there. And I, given we couldn't get through to anybody, I felt like no one was listening. Their tweet went viral. And within a few hours, the residents were rescued. Among the most vulnerable during Harvey have been the elderly. 94-year-old Henrietta Bell was trapped in her house with her daughter when the water rose two feet above her head. They waited to be rescued with their neighbors. I'm feeling a little tired. I'm glad to be here. I want to go in and sit down, put my feet up, and get something to eat. Are we going to get something to eat? <laughs> Other stranded residents took care of a sick 95-year-old neighbor while waiting for help. We've been out here since 7 o'clock. I haven't eaten, and um, he hasn't eaten. He's a diabetic, so they gave him the last crackers. They said they gave him the last four. I haven't eaten all day, and I take medication along with him, and I'm sure other people out here have medication problems as well. As the rescuers continue their work, folks from the photo that went viral decided to take their own picture, showing they are safely riding out the rest of the storm. Nursing home residents are now safe and secure at a different nursing home in Alvin, Texas, but their friends and family can't go and visit them because all the airports are still closed and the Houston roads, let's take a look. Most of them are flooded. More good news though, some of those nursing home managers tell us that everyone in that picture is in good spirits.